as a child in recovery from a lifetime that began in childhood of pathological narcissists, I'm learning now to actually hear that inner voice and all of that, that conditioning I had from waking up, being immediately under the gun, having to wake up at somebody else's timing, expected to chop, 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 be at full alert. Everybody has a waking up style. What kind is yours? And that's a, a child of a narcissist is looking now in recovery to have self-acceptance. So it's like observing. You become an anthropologist of your own innate characteristics because your characteristics and your traits you were told were wrong. Only the mothers were right. Everything she did was the embodiment of correct humanness. And so since you weren't like that, you then were inherently flawed. Something was wrong with you. That is how as a child of a narcissistic parent, you become vulnerable and susceptible to the pathological narcissist romantic interest as an adult. Because they're resonating, and I call it the key of N, narcissism, into what your mother, in this case mine, and I'm gonna use those terms from now on, the mother is the narcissist, throughout my entire story, the mother sets up conditional love. The mother criticizes. The mother tells the girl she is wrong for being who she is. And so when that girl grows up into a young woman and into womanhood, she's susceptible to those partners who then unconsciously fall right into line and act out the parent's role, which is to negate the child again and 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 again. Follow me. So women who have been through the grinder, yes, good news for women over 50. In my top five video in popularity, we are better off single. Because if you guys, the leftovers online and in the world are actually the narcissists that we've had to get away from, yeah, all you guys are is this right there. Back it up to 333 three, three, and you'll see what I mean. Yeah. So after going through hell and recognizing what a demonic force is, I can also tell you this, people. Demonic forces exist and they run through people. And if a human being or an AI bot or whatever commenter is entitied, whatever its primary body is, a comment it starts off as an insult that's demonic as I've said in other videos you may not have learned a thing or two you ought to be paying attention you ought to recognize that we crazy bitches have had enough with you horny bastards and we'd like you to stop it so stop watching porn stop jerking off stop being mad at us for not being ready at your beck and call. We know better. And you know something? When you know better, you do better. So women, you know, if you're recovering from a toxic relationship, 
Your oftentimes knee-jerk response is to jump right into another. Don't do that. No, 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 girls. Take responsibility. Because that is crazy, bitch. <laughs> and I've done it. That's why I know. Heal the psyche. Fly solo. Because flying solo is a acronym. S-O-L-O. -O. It's a scenic overlook. And it's a lovely opportunity for you to get to know who you are. And if you're, again, the child of a narcissistic parent, it's so nice <laughs> to... Um, be able to just relax and be yourself. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to exhibit the dog having a little squat pee pee session in the, in the on the lawn. That was kind of funny. But yeah, the um, the child of a narcissistic parent is once they get over their childhood. In my case, I was born in 1963, so I'm getting over it now. I, I'm grateful to be alive. I'm grateful for the opportunity to ground in the earth here uh, on this beautiful sunny morning. I'm grateful to have a dog in my life that I can walk and talk to and just hang out with. And I'm grateful to be able to observe myself and to see how I am as my human nature not according to how a narcissist decides I should act. And that's why flying solo is so important. How many of us women have had to jump through hoops for these guys? And it's our nature to do so. That's the thing. You know, we're, we're given verbal abuse coming and going. We're abused because we are conditioned to be, and when we say no to the abuser, we're called crazy bitches and what's wrong with us and you've been plowed and you've been tubed through and Chad's gotten you and you're going demons why would you wish that upon somebody I could be your sister I could be your mother it's like demons ah see so that's why they're so mean don't take it personal your mother was mean to you because she was intimidated by you. You're a superpower. The narc was mean to you because he wants to control you. But you're a superpower. And the demons online and everywhere else on social media where you're exposed and you put out your messaging want to defame you because they are simply doing what demons do. Lashing out with your venom. Well, don't let it, don't let it fret you any. We know what they are, that's all. And when you know better, you do better. And flying solo is how you get to know you better. So don't rush it. Scenic Overlook, a loving opportunity to love yourself. <laughs>